Have you ever wondered what it feels like to witness history? Imagine the tension in the air as the whistle blows, the roar of over 54,000 fans in Marvel Stadium Melbourne echoing across the pitch. It's the Matildas, Australia's beloved women's football team against Uzbekistan, and a spot in the Paris 2024 Olympics is on the line. The game begins, and in just 34 short seconds, Caitlin Torpy's cross ricochets off at Uzbekistan defender, and into the net, Australia is in the lead, the crowd erupts, the energy is palpable, you can feel the momentum building. Enter Michelle Heyman, a veteran striker, she has been gone from the national side since March of 2018, but tonight, she's back with a vengeance. In just 15 minutes, she lands a hat-trick, nailing every chance that comes her way. She's a force to be reckoned with, scoring four first-half goals and proving herself a key piece of the Matildas' attacking puzzle. The Matildas are relentless. They push forward, sweeping aside Uzbekistan with an exhilarating brand of football. They're not just playing for the win, they're playing for their 12th consecutive sellout crowd at home, for their largest ever crowd in Melbourne, for every young girl who dreams of kicking a ball. The first half concludes with an 8-0 lead for the Matildas, a testament to their dominance and a promise of what's to come. As the second half begins, the Matildas show no signs of slowing down. Mary Fowler, the second youngest Matilda to reach 50 caps, fires in the cross that leads to Heyman's first goal. She assists Heyman's third with a beautiful ball running down the flank. Then Fowler scores a goal of her own in the 36th minute, courtesy of a sharp turn and incisive pass from Katrina Gorey. Meanwhile, Caitlin Torpy, wearing Sam Kerr's number 20, is instrumental in every Australian attack. Her outstanding performance as a winger in these playoff matches might just force a rethink in coach Tony Gustafsson's plans for Paris. In the end, it's a resounding victory for the Matildas, a blistering 10-0 win, a record crowd, a dream 15-minute hat trick, and most importantly, a ticket to the Paris 2024 Olympics. This victory isn't just about the numbers, though. It's about the rise of women's football in Australia, a journey that dates back to the early 1900s. It's about overcoming financial constraints and lack of recognition, about building momentum and gaining public interest. It's about the Matildas who have not only qualified for the Olympics, but have done so in the most emphatic way possible. So what does it feel like to witness history? It feels like this. It feels like a perfect 10. Jump.